Hello everybody. Welcome back to our channel. If you're new, hello, welcome. Hope you're doing well, because we're, we're doing, doing amazing. amazing. for this video then yeah we are so so excited to do this video yeah. if you're new to our channel um i'm danielle i'm nathan and we've been together for and we're engaged <laughs> so, we've been together for four years now and we've been engaged for two of them years are you asking me or telling me i'm asking you <laughs> we just thought because we didn't vlog back then. two years ago when we yeah. got engaged we thought that you guys might want to yeah, our hear about, engagement story and hear some how we were and how we fell and obviously we were young. Nathan was 18 and I was 19, which is young to get engaged, like really young. Yeah. It is, and we know that. But yeah, we're just going to explain everything to you. We've got our little... Trusty travel photo album from the uh, this occasion. Was, yeah, we, we kind of make like a photo album or a... What's it called? Like, like a, a keepsake. A sketchbook, a, a sketchbook. Scrapbook? Scrapbook. A scrapbook of <laughs> sketchbook. Sketchbook. Of all like really important trips that we go on, like we made one for Disney and holidays and things like that. And this mm -hmm. is our engagement one, which we'll get into later. Yeah. So yeah, we really hope you enjoy this video and please, please, please subscribe. We yes. really It makes us so happy to yeah. see you all subscribing. We love you. Come on our adventure with <laughs> we us. Love you. We love you. We love you. I was gonna say we do love you, but we also love you joining us on our adventures. Yeah. And this was one of the most important ones of our life to date. So yeah, yes. let's get into the story the time. Let's go. The story time, oh my god. Have I'm we scared. done a story time before? <gasps> Is this going to be our we? first story time? Mm? Hey, it's going to be our first story time. That's exciting. Yeah. I look like a little kid. Like our first proper story time. Quick thing, my hair, I've literally said for the past like three videos about how greasy it is because it needs dyeing, but it's Nathan's birthday at the end it's of the month, greasy. so I'm trying to like hold out. Oh my god, there's something in my eye. We've got no plan for this video. There's so. literally no layout, so we're just going <laughs> to ramble. Right, where should we where start? Where should we start from? Well, what day did we get engaged? We got engaged on our anniversary, mm -hmm. like the anniversary that we got together, which is the 13th of February. Well done, Dinny. Well done remembering. Shut up, Nancy. Obviously, it's going to be I remember that one. It's like all this stuff that I forget. And where did we get engaged? We got engaged in London. Yeah. When we got together, mm -hmm. we went to Paris the first year. We went to... And Dinny thought we were going to propose then. I did. That's another no, story time. No, 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 no. That is another story time altogether. It's so embarrassing. We've literally only been together the, a uh, year. Yeah. When we went to Paris, it was, it was our and first we were even, year. And we were like... 17 then? 17, 18? You were 18, 18 and I was 17. <gasps> yeah, we'll talk about that another time. <laughs> yes. Yeah, so we went to Paris the first year, then the next year we, for our anniversary we went to London, which is this story time, then the one after that we went to Amsterdam, which we vlogged, mm -hmm. and then the one after that we went to the lakes, which is where we've just been, which we also yeah. vlogged. Um, well done for remembering all them. Thank you so I'm much, proud of you. Thank you. But yes, the time that we're talking about, we were going to London, just like our anniversary trip mm -hmm. it's like a little three-day getaway yeah which we stayed in um the hilton the double tree double by tree hilton. by double tree by hilton in, in canary wharf Can uh, no no canada water canada water and it was over it's like the river from the river. canary wharf yeah like you had to get a boat ride and everything oh uh, it was so such <laughs> a faff on we didn't know that you'd have to did we know no, i knew when i booked the hotel I'd... no we no, thought we, we could get together. the tube we thought we could get the tube and you couldn't. Yeah, but it did say on the website when you booked it that there's a two minute boat ride. Or Which we thought, tube. oh, that'll be fun. Like, that'll be yeah. cute. But not when not you have really to do how it. how choppy the water is. At like and... nine in the morning when you're going for breakfast somewhere in London and like so 11 bad. on a night, it was just mm -hmm. not great. Luckily, this was at the time when Danielle's foot wasn't at its worst. Yeah. So, because from the hotel, you got straight down into the lobby to then go into the boat which took you over the river yeah but then it was still like what another 15 minute walk. 20 walk to the actual nearest tube yeah so yeah, I, my foot was still bad then Do you remember it was still that? hurting because it, it, it but it was more like when you'd been on it for a long a longer time. time yeah whereas yeah. now the it's second literally... you step out the door it's constant isn't it yeah but like back then you could walk on it that's about. another story though how long before did you know you were gonna propose to me um what like no properly like yeah. that's gonna be the date. Not that long before. When really, did like... you buy the ring? 
that's a funny story. I ordered the ring at the beginning of January, which was cutting it really fine because Danielle's ring that we talked about was like very particular. We had spoke about it once before. Oh yeah. About proposal in the year before, like maybe like November time. Yeah, something and like Nathan that. And Nathan was like, what would you do if I proposed? And I was like, don't be ridiculous. <laughs> We're I was far like, too young. <laughs> I was like, my mum, I, obviously I wanted to, but I've mm. always got in the back of my mind because my mum is so protective. Yeah. I've always got in the back of my mind, like, what will my mum say? And because at that age, I was like, no. I was like, she would kill me. <laughs> no chance. Nathan was living with us and had yeah. been living with us for quite a while. Yeah. At this when he proposed yeah okay carry on Ring. anyway so yeah danielle's um picture in her mind was quite particular i'd say in a ring that she wanted so it was an opal stone on a white gold band or yeah a silver band. i would i don't like i don't really gold. like gold that much and i just wear silver pandoras and stuff so i mm -hmm. would just prefer a silver ring an opal oh wow it's so beautiful so hard to find it, it's not what no i would i always said oh my god i would love an opal uh -huh. engagement ring like i'd never really seen any i'd seen like a couple of like probably ones from america that were like mm -hmm. five thousand pounds <laughs> but it's not like your typical ring no it's, it's not. very like a lot of people i know a lot of people have looked at it when they've asked me oh like show me the ring and they're like oh that's lovely because it? it's not a diamond it's not your big yeah. shiny it's not your little shiny it's mm, just it's an opal this i've got it on now and uh, along with a promise ring i'm going to insert some pictures now like close-ups of the ring um i've got an, a different ring on with it because i had a different promise ring from that nathan done in paris story time. yeah so it won't <laughs> be the same as it is now with like this one on um i don't know if you'll be able to see it Where we live, no jewellery stores do an opal stone on a white gold band or a silver band or anything. So it got to the beginning of January and I was like, that's the that's the ring that I need. Yeah. That that is the only one that I need because everything like everything else I was looking at was too like blingy. Yeah. It was too diamondy and like and like you would have liked it but it wouldn't have been you. Yeah. Like it wouldn't have matched Danielle. I would have been happy with anything yeah. though because yeah. a lot of people I know do pick their own engagement rings mm -hmm. like say oh my god like I'd love that like I love that engagement ring I love that one mm -hmm. and like the partner obviously can just be like great I'll, I'll pick yeah, any of them ones I didn't know I didn't see this at all until the minute I got it yeah. I didn't know what it would look like anything mm -hmm. so I ordered it from a store in London which is actually where we were going. I could have picked it up while we were there, but that would have been a bit too iffy if we actually went to the store where it was. So I think that would have gave it away, bearing yeah. in mind I had no idea. Absolutely none. So I ordered, I had to order a custom because the store actually had a gold band with Opal, obviously, but I had to custom order it, which they said it would take six weeks, and that six-week date took us to the day before we went to London, which is scary. <laughs> so I ordered it, and then it actually got to the day before and I was like, I remember being sat on the bed and I was like looking and you were going, what are you looking for? And I was like, oh, nothing. <laughs> you know, because it was on special delivery so it should get delivered before 1pm. And it didn't come before 1pm so I was like, this and isn't going to happen. I thought it was just uh, an anniversary like gift. An anniversary present, like an anniversary present, Like a yeah. cute anniversary gift. So it got to the time and then I think it was like half three and I seen the Royal Mailman come. And he had a box and I was like, oh, thank God, it's here. <laughs> so it nearly didn't happen while we were there, but it did. Yeah. It came in time. Okay, so that's the ring story. <laughs> what did we do on the day? On the day of the proposal. On the day. It was a shopping day. So, obviously, <laughs> I had no idea. Mm -mm. And we plan all our, like, itinerary, because that's just how we are. We'd, yeah. like, everything planned out. Um, so we'd planned the day, Nathan obviously couldn't say anything, mm -hmm. so we went to Oxford Street and done some shopping, we went to Sketch, didn't we, the really yeah. cool restaurant, like tea place, like we were going to see Wicked, was that that night? No? No, no that, that was the, that, that was the first night. What were, what were we going oh, to Oh no, do? that was the third night. We were just going for tea, weren't we? We just went to Jamie's. That was it. We'd booked Jamie Oliver's restaurant because we just, we honestly thought we were so cool back then and we <laughs> thought we had to go to like a dead cool place. And we actually booked that on the day. We Whilst did. we were on the top floor of H&M, I was like, 
I haven't got a restaurant booked. And I was like, oh, and then I'd seen Jamie's online. And I but was you like, wouldn't have been able to book anything yourself because I would no. not. If Nathan come to me and was like, oh, like we're going to eat for tea, I'd be like, what? Show <laughs> yeah. me the menu, show me the review, show me where it is, how yeah, long does it true. take to get there? I'd literally have 50 questions. So, yeah. so that we booked that together work. on the day. Yeah. And luckily there was a space left. Um, Denise, can you remember what you had? To I eat on that had. Night? So for starters, we had. Um, oh, wait, 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 we wait, wait. What we're we missing? We're missing the, the main bit of the story, then. <laughs> before we went out for tea, oh. before we went, uh, we all got. We all? We all. We got all ready to go out to Jamie's. Hmm. If you can hear banging outside, I'm sorry, oh, it's just yeah. next door doing work. They're doing <laughs> building work. Um, yeah, so we got all ready and came down in like a lift that was in like the hotel. It was a really weird but cool hotel. Yeah. Um, so yeah, we came down the lift. I waited in this like big aisle where that I could see like all the Canary Wharf skyline thing. Mm. Walking, 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 that. walking, Nathan, what did you say? I said, oh, I forgot my phone. Which is just normal for Nathan. Yeah. Not, I didn't think anything of it. I was literally actually fuming. I was like, are you joking? <laughs> I was like, hurry up. Table's I'm... booked in like half an hour and they've got like, yeah. it takes Me, 20 I'm minutes getting to get stressed out. I was like, Nathan, hurry up. I'm waiting here. I'm not coming back up with you. Just hurry up. So I was like, great, fine. You can wait here because that is the plan. So at this point, I was kind of like getting a bit nervous. But I, you didn't show it. Point. Oh, no. I tried to like get my acting skills on and all that. I went back up to the room and then I took the ring which was in the little box out yeah. of my travel bag which was there all along. Can you believe it? You no. slept in the room with yeah, the no. ring there. Crazy. So I went up to the room and then I bought like little fake flower uh, rose petals and yeah. just like did a little trail <laughs> as you came in the door and then I did like a circle of them which was at where I was going to be down on one knee. So I did that and then I actually didn't take that long, did I? No. I actually literally took two minutes. Two seconds. But as I was doing it, as I was scattering them all, so like so they were perfectly in a line, I was like, oh my god, I was sweating. I had a big coat on. So I was like, this is getting ridiculous. So I had to do it as quick as possible. It felt like I was in there an hour. Good. He had to go up and down this lift and this lift took ages. I yeah. just thought it was taking ages in the lift. And you didn't actually take that long. No, for me I to didn't. be like, what the hell? Like, what I didn't ring yeah. it normally like anything longer than like two minutes. I'd be like, what are you doing? Hurry up, yeah, like, ring him. Went to Jamie's, got there just on time, I think. Yeah. Um, it was a very, very posh menu. <laughs> very, very posh. posh. Yes. Also, we felt like we had to have a cocktail because he was like, what alcoholic drink would you like? And, and we were I like, just know we don't drink. We don't drink, but back then we like sometimes felt like we had to. Yeah. Like, I mean, we did, like, we did want one, kind of. I mean, I would have preferred not to pay I would have preferced pound. a Diet Coke. Yeah, or I would have preferred an apple juice. <laughs> yeah. But we were like, oh, yeah, uh, we'll have, like, two of them cocktails. I'll put the cocktail on the screen because I know I've got a picture of them. They did look nice. They did and they did taste nice. nice. Yeah. Then, for starters, we had a, a big loaf of garlic bread. Which we it was shared. literally a loaf. No, we didn't. We got one each. Did we? Yeah. <gasps> and then the only thing I could see on the menu that I like vaguely <laughs> liked was it was called oxtail lasagna, mm -hmm. which I thought was just a fancy name for a lasagna. Yeah. Ate it absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> literally, I loved it so much. What a yummy lasagna. Found out later on it's an actual ox's tail. Gonna <laughs> throw up. We'll never eat that again in my life. Anyway, what did you have then? I had uh, steak and chips. Steak and chips. Just steak and chips, regular steak and chips. Yeah, and then after that, after Jamie's, we had a little wander around mm -hmm. and then headed back to the hotel because we're not really like party people or anything no. so yeah we, we like just, chill nights don't we yeah we went back to the hotel <sighs> and then i can't even remember how did it even go so we went it's all lift, very vague for me i when when it was about to happen when we actually arrived in the hotel i felt like every second was going so slow did you yeah we were walking <laughs> through and i was i know i kept quiet like i was staying quiet the whole time i was in the hotel yeah so as we were walking up in the lift the lift takes long anyway but this one <laughs> felt like we were stuck in the lift we got into the corridor of where our hotel door hotel room door was yeah and danielle was walking off in front and i was hanging behind on my phone unbeknown to danielle that i was getting up the song that like is our song which yeah. is the foray you found me yeah it's you know like 
if you're a couple or like your friends or you just have a song with somebody which you just like mm. it's like oh my god it's our song like yeah. you relate to the song it is like quite a sad song but cute song at the same time yeah sorry we just put the stuff the camera and started recording again where, where was were we that? up to walking this song. up putting the song on yeah so i had the song ready to play and daniel was going what what are you doing i remember and then i remember being like oh we hurry up and open the door yeah. i think i need <gasps> i remember oh. i needed a poo <laughs> yeah, that is did. it. I needed the yeah, toilet. Oh my goodness! I actually remember. And as you can tell, Dinny was literally on the on the edge. I was. I was like, "We just hurry up, open the door, Nathan. Get, where's the key?" And he was going, uh, "One second. I was like, Nathan, get off your phone. I just find the key. I need the toilet." We put the song on, <gasps> and then I gave Danielle the key, and Danielle opened the door, and then that's where it was. Oh my God. What was your first reaction from this moment on? Daniel didn't say any words until approximately 20 minutes, 25 minutes. It's the weirdest reaction. Like, I never... You kind of picture in your mind how you'll react to somebody proposing to you. Like, oh, wow, oh my God, mm. yes, yes, yes. Cuddle, cuddle, cuddle. Yeah. No, 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 <laughs> not no. With, not with Dinny. Not with me. I don't know what happened to me. I went into total shock. Like... Mm -hmm. Didn't I? You just and like, all I remember is like constant issues like this. Oh, I had my hands off my face because I face. didn't want. I did, I don't know. I just didn't want you to look at me. I just because <laughs> I couldn't believe. I don't know why that you wanted to like marry me or, or like be with me forever. Like it was just oh, so man. weird because we were young. Like you have to remember that we yeah, were very young. as much as we like. You probably if you on our channel all the time you'll know like we kind of act older than we are we're both mm -hmm. no we're not both i'm 22 and nathan's 21 i'm 22 soon <laughs> but we like act older i feel as yeah. much as we're like weird and immature and everything like that we do act older when it comes to adult things yeah, yeah. well we try anyway <laughs> yeah um yeah so i was just i just kept my eyes in nathan was literally i don't remember I what you said what did you do you remember what you said uh, i remember bits of it I remember I I didn't say a lot because I couldn't. Yeah. Like I was I was but getting choked up myself. How strange is that? We were like so comfortable with each other. We knew that mm. obviously he knew I'd say yes. It was never like a thing in your mind that I'd say no. You was got it? me thinking at one point when you weren't answering me. I was like I couldn't oh, answer. This is bad. Nothing. <laughs> n everything kind of like stopped. I don't. I just even a poo stopped. <laughs> She didn't need the anymore. <laughs> but oh, it was just so weird. It was and so surreal, wasn't it? it? It's one of them things that I think I had that much adrenaline. Mm -hmm. Like, it's not clear in my mind how it was what and happened? the feelings and things like that. Like, yeah. I really, really wish we vlogged then. Me too. Like, I really do. I was literally like this. And he was like, <laughs> see? So and well, I yeah. was like... <laughs> <laughs> and I, I literally still, was charging around the room at one point, I remember. Yeah, I still don't actually think you said yes. Until we were like messing around there yeah. and you were like, you didn't actually you say didn't yeah. Me. I was <laughs> yeah. like, duh, yeah. <laughs> the was deed that? happened. Yeah. Oh, that Nitty. sounded a bit inappropriate, didn't it? I don't think you... The, <laughs> the proposal happened <laughs> I think and then this is where the funny, funny, another funny part comes into it. So, so we uh, were all like giddy when we like, oh my god, we're engaged. Yeah, oh, Ooh. another thing is you had on the bed laid out um, a Victoria's Secret little nighttime Lingerie. set. Yeah. It was on the bed, which was a really cute little um, addition. addition. Yeah. <laughs> Before all this, by the way, I did get Danielle's mum and dad's permission, oh, which yeah, yeah, was, yeah. for some reason, was actually more scary than proposing to you. That's one of the first things I said to you. I was like, oh, do my mum and dad know? I was like, do <laughs> yeah. my mum and dad know? Who knows? <laughs> it was honestly, because for some, I don't know why, like, Danielle's mum and dad are the most caring, like, loveliest parents in the world, but, like, to actually have to sit down, like, I don't do well with one-on-one -on -one conversations with people anyway no, no matter who you are no so when i had to plug up the courage and be like dave can i talk to you <laughs> them words wouldn't come out my mouth for weeks and even though because i told danielle's mum first because i don't know why i did i think it just came up in conversation as in like what would you do if i proposed to danielle it was kind of like one of them so i think nikki actually told dave that i wanted a word with him regarding something along the lines of 
proposing. Yeah. So he knew for weeks. And then the second I sat down with him and said, <laughs> oh, um, I need to, how would you feel if I uh, proposed to Daniel? He went, oh, that's and he said, well, it's about time. I've been waiting for this for weeks. And I was like, oh my <laughs> yeah. God. There was times though, we were both cooking in the kitchen at the same time. And I was going, and I just couldn't, and I'd, and I'd like just sit there and I'd be like, why? He was right there, why didn't I just say it? Because it is the easiest thing to talk to Nikki and Dave, like your mum and dad. Yeah. Like it's the easiest thing in the world, but for some reason, I just couldn't. But I did in the end. But after it, we were like, oh my god, my, sis my little sister Kaylin knew. She was we... the only one that knew it was going to happen there. Yeah, we played a little prank on her. <laughs> uh, Nathan messaged her like after being like, oh, like I couldn't, I couldn't do it, do I'm not going to do it here. And she was like, oh, you're joking. Oh mm. my God, really? But then she was like supportive. She was like, oh, don't worry. No matter where you do it, she'll love it. It's going to yeah. be the best, like no matter what. And we were like crying on the bed. Because we knew we already were. <laughs> yeah. And obviously so we didn't cruel. put it anywhere until we came home and told all the family first. Yeah. We were like, oh my God, like we need to take some pictures of like, mm the ring and us like just in the moment I had makeup everywhere you'll see on the pictures <laughs> that we put in I just had makeup everywhere I like patchy Nathan you had your ponytail then did I yeah oh my god your I did ponytail. yeah um and we were like oh my god we need like some champagne to put in a picture like <laughs> don't what? champagne who do we think we, we are? don't even Champagne. I don't think I'd I, I don't think I'd even tried champagne a bloody expensive bottle of champagne as well but we went I was like, oh, Nathan, you go down to the bar. Like, there was a bar in the hotel on the <laughs> floor down from us. I was like, you go to the bar and just get the cheapest bottle of something that you can get. I was like, we'll have, like, one drink, maybe. Like, there's a little glass. We might have, like, one drink. No intention to have the one drink. But we're like, we can't just, like, get some alcohol for a pitcher. Mm. <laughs> but we just... I don't know so, why we felt like we had to do that. Hold on. I think it was just literally for the pitcher, though. That's why we wanted it. We were like, it. oh, well, it's a celebration, so... We're Pop the champagne in there. Have a weird, weird people. Like, I went downstairs and got the bottle of champagne. Yeah. Felt like a proper adult, like, asking for it. I was like... Hiya, could I get a bottle of your champagne, Hiya. please? <laughs> like trying to act all like smart and like, yeah, I haven't just proposed to my girlfriend or anything, you know what I mean? So, took it upstairs, got a Even though anybody else would have been like, mm. oh, I've just proposed, and they probably would have went, oh, yeah. have it on the house, not us, no, no, no. no. Can I have a bottle of champagne, please? <laughs> Do you want ice? Yeah. <laughs> Go on then. So, Brought I took it, it back up to up. the room. I was like, oh, I was like, yeah, that'll do, babe. How much was it? 30-ish, 30, yeah. something, 29 30, maybe, 28. Yeah, something like that. I was literally like, you're joking. <laughs> Over a bottle. So that we're not even, I was like, we're drinking it now. I'm not joking. I was like, Nathan, we're drinking it. I don't care if you don't like it, we're having it. Part of right. glass, didn't we? Mm -hmm. Part of glass each, put it on the bedside table, then put it just on the floor <laughs> beneath the bed. because The was, whole bottle. Yeah, there was nowhere else to put it. We put it like in the bucket thing that they give you. Yeah. The pictures and everything. And yeah. then... I well, insert the pictures that we took on the bed now. Yeah. Then what happened? Um, Nathan got off the bed. Mm -hmm. Can't remember why you got off the bed. Mm, got off the bed, kicked the full expensive bottle of champagne <laughs> all over all the floor. All over the floor. All, oh, all over it the floor. It stunk, didn't it? It stunk. There was nothing left in it. <laughs> I was like, are you joking? Are you actually joking? £30 carpet cleaner. £30 absolutely down the drain because it just went all over the carpet. It was worth it because it was a proposal. And that was our first <laughs> engaged proposal. Um, <laughs> Sorry? <laughs> that was our first engaged argument yeah. about how Nathan spilt it everywhere. So yeah, we were just chilling. We were literally like, I can't believe it. We were, I don't even know if we, we were just like, I can't believe it, babe. Can you believe can't it? Remember. I can't believe it. Didn't feel real. No, it actually didn't feel real. We were just like, what the hell? And then I was like, anyway, I'm going to go to the toilet because <laughs> yeah, all of a sudden... Yeah, because needed this poo for so long. I was like, all of a sudden, I really need the toilet again. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that's probably too much information. Probably, but, but that's what Sorry, it's just, just what happened. Yeah. We, we want every detail of the story, so that's <laughs> just what happened. Can't believe um, it. And yeah, after that, we were then engaged. Engaged. Um... Yeah, so we'll go Basically, on to that's the story. that is the story. Yeah, I don't think we've missed anything, but we'll go on to show you the scrapbook now. Mm -hmm. So obviously, this book is our whole London trip. So there'll be like the day the before other, the anniversary the day, day and the day after. Yeah. Okay. Here we go. 
Where's it start? Oh, this is the card that I got Danielle of all the pictures. Oh, there's look some how old young pictures we look. there. That was that when was we went to Benidorm. Oh, yeah, that was Paris. Like, we look so young. That was one of the first ever pictures we got together. Oh, my God, it was. Yep. Okay, and then inside, that's just a little Just all soppy. And... Message. Oh, look what I used to call you all the time. I still do call you that because that's what you are, but... Yeah. You, Mermacorn. Can't believe it's been two years. Oh, so, yeah, we also did this really cute thing with them, but we'll go on to that after this. This is the flowers. I think this was a flower card. That was when we got back home, yeah. So this is what we started when we first got to the hotel. We wrote it on these little pieces. Was it napkins or was no, it No, it was paper? a notebook. A notebook in like the actual hotel pad. room. So that was the first one that we did. Daniel and it's got the date up there. Oh, Sorry about my nails. They're getting done. 12th of the second 17. <laughs> it says forever and always. That's what we always say to each yeah. other. Our train tickets. One of the ferry tickets from the boat because obviously that was like really funny to yeah. us that we had to get a boat all the time. Our tube tickets. Yep. Yeah. Then we've got a picture from in the tube with a Costa coffee, a picture on the train. What <laughs> is that? <laughs> My God. We look like babies. Oh, this was the, the room. room. Oh, Yep, so I had a little purple lip. Mm, look at my hair. Gorgeous. I liked it though. Some more selfies, some more selfies. So yeah, this was when we were shopping, just not really much to look at, but this then is this sketch. was a sketch, yeah. Funny story about them sugar um, cubes there. Took us about half an hour to actually pluck up the courage to ask for some sugar. That was me looking at somebody <laughs> like, please bring me the sugar. Look at the bun. So cute. Then more shopping and Victoria's Secret and um, lovely yummy cake. Mm -mm -mm. Then Here we go. this is the night time. So few of us. us. I've still kept that top. I've only wore it once since because it's one of them things. It's kind of like your wedding dress and your prom dress mm -hmm. where I just want to keep it forever. Mm -hmm. I can't look how believe beautiful it. she looks. Oh, selfies. Selfies Oh, look at Dinny. Stop it, Nin. <gasps> Here and it that's is. That's when it happened. So that was our second note. Yeah. Uh, she said yes. And there's the date off the top there. This is the rose petals that Nathan put on the floor. And little um, confetti. Confetti hearts. Then up here, that's the, the expensive bottle of wine that went all got. over the floor. Oh, can you see them all over the bed as well? They were literally everywhere, weren't they? Nathan? Yeah. It was a gorgeous bed, that as well. That's the little lingerie. Yep, yeah, that Nathan put on the bed. And they're the ones I put on the screen as well. All of them I'll have put on. Look at that was literally Nathan, honestly, <laughs> about two minutes after, wasn't it, Nathan? Yeah. So this was the one that Dinny wrote to I me wrote this. on the day we went home on Valentine's Day. I put, you are my fiancé, I love you, my forever and always, oh, my forever and always happy V-Day with loads, loads of love, of love hearts. hearts. This was us on Valentine's Day. Then we went to see Wicked on the night, which oh, was yeah. amazing. Oh and yeah, we went home, home on the 15th. Yep. It's home time. I've had one of the most amazing times of my life. I came to London with a girlfriend and leaving with a fiancé. Wow! In the back is just all, all of, of our, our cards. engagement cards. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> I'll just do this and cuddle you like this. So Denny, we're now engaged. How do you feel? <laughs> we're being engaged for <laughs> We've been engaged for two years and it will be a long engagement because we do live at my mum and dad's house and our family home. Yeah. Um, it, Nathan lives with us and he's lived with us, like we said, for how long now? Like three? Be four years in October. Four years in October. I didn't move in that long after we got together. Yeah, which again, I understand how people would judge because I probably... Not judge in like a horrible way, but yeah. judge as in like, like I can't curious believe you're as together to already. like, like you're curious together. as to why they're living together already. Yeah. Like, because you do, you're like, oh my god, they've moved in together like four months. And especially after. with it being into Danielle's mum and dad's house, like not Dan, like not Our your own, own house. house, yeah, yeah. Um, but there is a lot of reasons behind that which we may go into one right time on, the line. on a story time. But now that we're vlogging, you will come along. On that everything with us now. So no matter, so the soon as we start planning everything, like new house, like everything. Babies, wedding, here. everything, you're going to be with us. Yeah. Well, hopefully oh, you're yeah. going to be with us. Yeah. So we really hope you did enjoy this story time video. And if you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. And a like. And don't forget to subscribe because it makes us so happy to see us all coming along on our adventures. It does. And um, we'd really love to do more story time. So let us know if you liked 
yeah this. I know it can be a bit much sometimes just people talking mm. and we have included like pictures and stuff yeah and um, but other story times will probably just be us talking so let us know how we actually did like did we do good at story time or did, did we, we annoy we did you did yeah. please let us know we <laughs> so we will see you all in the next video peace, peace out, out.